Hey guys, Razor here, back with another video, and as you guys can see, it's a completely different video. I usually upload montage videos, but today I'm just showing a tutorial on how to uh, get stretched res on Fortnite Chapter 2 Season 2 for Fortnite Battle Royale. Another thing is, usually on the stretched res videos, it's always NVIDIA uh, graphics cards, but uh, today I'm going to show you how to do it in AMD Radeon settings. But, and yeah, let's get into the video. So to begin with you need to open up your local app data so this is the code just quick click the windows and r button and you should open up run uh, percent local app data percent uh, open it and find up find your fortnite games file open up saved config windows client and first check if you got read only on because you want to change your change the value so you scroll down or you can do control like you go edit replace and then just type in 1920 or the res that you are currently using and replace it with the res you want so currently the best res out there is 1080 and yeah let's go just click replace all so you should replace all of the 1920 by 1080 things so if you scroll down uh, everything here you see resolution size x resolution size y everything's just changed click the x button here file save close out that window game user settings the key important thing is to put it on read only. If you don't put on read only, it will not work. So apply. Okay. Close out your file there. Open up your AMD. So usually AMD settings. Usually you start in the home, and if you want to navigate to the thing, you have to click this uh, settings uh, button here, and then uh, navigate to display. You go to display. Uh, open up custom resolution here. Usually it will have a terms and agreements. Just click accept. Um, as you can see, I've already got the customers, but all you have to do is create new, uh, change your resolution up here to 1080 or the, the desired resolution size. I'll probably put some on the screen with it, which you can, which is very popular, but like, yeah. And then you go down here to time and display, change that to 1080 as well. And then the main important thing is usually that, that, that people usually miss out is change this from manual to CVT. If you want, if you're on AMD, you have to change the CVT and it'll change some of these values will allow it to work for your thing and uh, yeah that's how I got my 1080 times 1080 uh, 44 hertz at one point hertz a key important thing to remember before you do before doing that is make sure that you got GPU scaling enabled and you got your scaling mode as full panel if you do not have this I don't know about Nvidia because I don't have an Nvidia graphics card but for AMD just remember to have full panel and GPU scaling on because without that I don't think it won't work like it will just change your aspect ratio of your screen and it just will just ruin your thing so yeah change it to 1080 by 10, 1080 or the desired screen that you've chosen keep changes and um, I run 144 so what I need to do is quickly go to display that's a proper display monitor and change this to 144 so I can actually see 144 hertz apply Go to that screen, keep changes, okay, and then now just simply just run Fortnite. If you guys are here in this video because you want to know how to do it by 1080 by 1080, which is probably the best res out there in Fortnite currently, as you get the biggest FOV out there, uh, then you, you would need a controller because, uh, as you would see, you want to click on the I don't know what it's called, the armory or something like that. Uh, you want me to click on it, so you need a controller. But if you're playing any other res, I think anything above 1444, you won't need a controller for it. So, yeah, just keep that in mind before you progress. Okay, as you see, it's very stretched right now. Uh, change this to creative, and this is when you need to get your controller. So, like, you see, click ready up straight away, and then. Left D pad and left dead. So ready up, creative. And then we just, as you can see, we're going to get this. And then we go into a game. This is how you know you've done it correctly because you literally, uh, also called, went into, well, you literally readied up and things. So now as you can see, we've got stretch reds. This you can actually see way more. 